shit that on my phone. Come with me. me. You can, I, yeah, I can get my other Phone the phone at the house. Take where you want. Both you can take your phone, but I want to get on the phone. My other phone is high too. I don't know. Can I grab this and put this inside, please? Because I, I'm, I can't afford to lose a lot of money. Can I do it? Can you please put that inside? Can we? I'm gonna put it right. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. Right. 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 What? Fucking eight hundred dollars for an iPhone. I can't afford that shit. I Check it out, man. Check it out. Now I'm not gonna lie, man. I'm used to too much fucking pranks that when some real shit happen, I'm thinking it's a joke. Now today I'm watching one of my favorite people to watch on Instagram Live. Is go that but like the project, baby. And even though he fucks around a lot, a lot of times on there, and he slurred like a motherfucker. He usually kicks some jewels in between. Today he was talking about really just life and people who like to work, who talk about music and all that shit. However, at one point when he went live, he the phone was up and people were saying what the fuck is going on. However, we heard somebody that sounded like a cop and the cop was talking about we're getting this, we're getting this. You go here, you go here. And then we heard the cop said we're taking your phone because it's part of the search warrant. And at that point I said this nigga kodak ain't serious he can't be pulling the boonk on us however kodak black don't play those type of games because he is a real street nigga and of course if you realize what he's been involved in recently yes he's been going at a bunch of florida rappers but that's all we know publicly we also know he's on probation we also know he has an open pendant charge in north carolina and we now know that his phone was indeed taken into custody as part of the search warrant, but he was also taken into custody, okay? Kodak Black has been arrested again for probably the fifth time in a year and a half, and this time, it's not just a probation violation because they came and picked him up with a warrant. They actually, they locked him up on all type of charges. I'm going to give you the charges he got now. And by the way, I just want to say this. I'm going to preface this before even going down these charges. I don't know where they're coming from, but... I, if I had to bet, all that Instagram live back and forth with him and a couple Florida rappers probably sparked a warrant, and that probably led to people running up in his house. Okay, now he got a charge of grand theft of a firearm, so clearly a uh, firearm may have been stolen. Somebody says uh, possession of weapons or ammo by a felon. In, a felon. Uh, that's a Florida felon. That's an adult felon. And also possession of weapon or ammo, which is probably the same thing, or maybe it's just multiple guns. We have weed. We have child neglect. So maybe the, the child was around this type of stuff. Who knows what they found? Probation violation. Those are just mandatory because he's already on probation. This is incredibly sad. I Honestly, man, I thought Kodak was really on some other stuff. Um, however, I've always said Kodak Black is too street for this music business. He's always talked about how he misses the street. We heard when he was beefing with niggas from Florida, he said the only reason why in the hood or back in the streets is because of house arrest. So we all thought he was doing good because he was in a nice big old mansion that he bought. Uh, if these things are true, and again, I'm just reading charges. I don't know if none of this shit is true. If all these things are true, Kodak Black fucked up. And Kodak Black won't be out for a long time, okay? Because those probation violations is going to keep him in. And even if he bails out, because some of the bails here are just for like $1,000, even if he is kept in, right? Or actually, even if he, he um, was allowed to get on bail for that, he has other cases, two other cases where he was on probation for. So unfortunately, Kodak Black won't be out for a long time. Unfortunately, Kodak Black may have squandered his opportunity at freedom for the entire 2018, and I'm hoping I'm wrong. I'm hoping, Okay. But it doesn't look good. Hold your head, Kodak Black. If I get any more information, I'll pass it on to you guys. But Kodak Black is now in custody immediately. Get in the comment box. Make sure you guys like them. Subscribe to Boots Academics. Oh!